Hello, I'm Zach Runkle, and tonight is Halloween night. And what better way to spend the night than to share scary stories in the middle of nowhere. So sit back, relax, in horror and fright, as I share with you the story of Shirtless Steve. One day, there was a man named Dave. Dave was walking home from work one day because his car was in the shop, and he had a rotisserie chicken with him for dinner. But the chicken was haunted. The box shook. The chicken popped out and screeched and scared Dave to death. And he woke up in the deepest pit of hell where he met the great demon king. Well, if it isn't Dave, you're trapped here in hell. But if you manage to escape, you'll win your freedom back on earth as a ghost. Dave knew what he had to do. He explored and made it through the nine circles of hell and explored the various other shapes hell had to offer, like the squares, and the triangles, and the pentagons, and the spheres, and the cubes, and finally to the most important of all, the rings of hell, where he faced such monsters and foes like Ben 10, Big Ben, Ben 10 again, Ben 10 again again, Ben 10 again again again, and other people not named Ben, like Badass Bill and the Wizard. Finally, as the champion of hell, his shirt ripped off through all of his adventures, he gained a nickname for himself, Shirtless Steve, and the Demon King met him and said, Oh, Dave, you've done a good job for yourself, and you have earned your freedom. You are now a ghost, free to roam the earth, but you must take on a new name. So Dave went with the name he earned in the ring, Shirtless Steve, and proceeded to haunt the earth as a boxing champion. Of course, this didn't sit well with the other ghosts. Ghosts aren't supposed to fight people, ghosts are supposed to scare people. So he went to ghost school and learned how to possess things. And so he went to a store, a grocery store, where he found rotisserie chickens sitting on a table, and he decided to hide in one. And a man named Alan picked the chicken up and took it home with him. Of course, he was walking home because his car was in the shop, and the box began to shake, and Alan was scared to death, and he woke up in the deepest pits of hell and was challenged to make it out and roam the earth as a ghost. And he took on the name of Shirtless Steve. The end. Zach, that is the dumbest story I've ever heard. Perhaps. Happy Halloween.